call this ankle twi- twisting gate? Because I'm from D.C., so everything that's, you know, kind of controversial, I call it gate something. And Everyone's that is calling everything gate. It's getting annoying. we got to think of something uh, a little bit better than that. Nope, I'm going to call it gate. Ankle twisting gate is what I'm going to call it. <laughs> but then that is Vontez Perfect. That's a very interesting name, too. He is a linebacker for the Cincinnati Bengals. This past weekend, he was caught very, very blatantly at the end of tackles, twisting, violently twisting the ankles of players that were down on the ground. First, he did it to Cam Newton, kind of tackled Cam Newton by the legs. While he was rolling up, you see him go twisting his ankle the wrong way, trying, looking, it looked like he was trying to intentionally hurt Cam Newton. And then later on in the game, did the same thing and actually did hurt Greg Olson, the tight end. And I mean, it wasn't even close. Like, remember a couple months ago That's when we terrible. talked about That's J.R. Like... Smith untying somebody's shoelaces at the free throw line? That's funny. Twisting and trying to intentionally hurt another player is just, it's just wrong. I mean, how did this it, guy not get so the many of chainsaw? Because Jameis Winston did something stupid. So does yeah, this guy. Stupid. Like this guy's doing something. Yeah, he did something stupid. Not... This guy's doing something intentionally. Like just it's more malicious. That's than... stupid. Yeah, this is vicious. Vicious is what you really want to go after. Stupid will take care of itself. It'll yeah. stupid itself out. Yeah, this well. guy. This guy needs some Chewbacca to to come after him. <laughs> well, I mean, what do you think, Chewbacca? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, you heard him. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. But it just it was it was kind of ridiculous. Now he got fined twenty five thousand dollars by the NFL, and he is going to be appealing it. Which uh, I mean, I guess it doesn't hurt to appeal it because maybe he'll get five thousand dollars or something like that knocked off. But I just think that somebody else should like take him out. Like you're gonna see one of these twenty five thousand dollars for for trying to intentionally twist the ankles of two other players, including like some high end players, like Cam just Newton, from yeah. a business perspective. You're trying to cost someone a lot of money, yeah. and let alone the fact that you're trying to twist a bunch of guys' ankles. Like, yeah, no now, and I'm all for, I know injuries happen in the NFL. It is a violent sport. It is very physical. These guys are hitting each other. But they don't intentionally do it. Like, exactly. You're not intentionally, not intentionally twist trying something to break after somebody. the game, after the play and everything. So it was just kind of ridiculous. And uh, Vontez Perfect, I hope you are subject to a chop block. And if you don't know what a chop block is, that is where you are being blocked by one person and somebody comes and cuts your legs out from underneath you. Um, and actually, I don't wish that on it because that could probably hurt really bad too. But this yeah, is I just, just ridiculous. I, I think I mean, that he on. should get worse than 25000 He should be personally. suspended if you ask me. I really think he Absolutely should be Absolutely suspended. suspended. Uh, and he should lose his game check, which would probably be between two hundred and five hundred thousand dollars, you know, because what he was doing was trying to hurt another player. And really, come on, I, I'm surprised that the players and he should you play need... for their uh, the the medical bills. Yeah, because he did hurt too. one player, didn't he? So yeah, he did. But I don't know how seriously, but he did hurt him. Yeah, so whatever um, it is. And it's funny that the NFLPA, you know, the Players Association, is like standing behind him, like helping him well, appeal. This is a player this. on player thing, like yeah, just... that's what I'm saying. It's like what, no, don't. You We're not two guys you. You're trying to hurt some of our other guys. Like, as opposed to one. <laughs> you're hurting other players. It's not the league against you. It's you against other players, and the league is kind of telling you, no, you're not allowed to do that. So. Maybe, maybe the players' association should be, should be uh, fining him or whatever, if they have the power to do that. Yeah, they don't. They do not. A union doesn't have the power. Well, I guess they might. They, they could kick him out. Wouldn't that be interesting if they kicked him out of the union? Would he be allowed to play? I don't know. I don't, I don't know if the question. NFL's locked in. I thought that they were a lock in... Uh, uh, league that required you to be part of the union, but I don't know. That'd be interesting. I don't know. Let us know what you think. Hit us up. Comments down below. Uh, should be pu- should he be punished more? Should he be punished less? Uh, hit us up. Comments down below. Of course, at what's my face on Twitter. What's my face at gmail.com and Google Plus and Facebook. Always good ways of getting a hold of us. Let's move it on to uh, some injury updates. And it looks like Calvin Johnson will be missing this week again. Um, and so for all you people who own him in your fantasy league. This guy here and drafted him in the first round this guy right here and he's really killing your team yeah I'm sorry I feel your pain I feel your pain um, and yeah well, that's all the injury news I really got for you so that's not bad that's not a bad week other yeah, than... I'm sure there's other injuries yeah. out there but I think he's the biggest highest profile um, that you know that's the new there were there were a lot of guys that had been pretty big um, players that were injured that came back this last week, so I guess things are doing better. 
Mm, you, know, it's, you know, it's the NFL, though. It's a physical sport. So when know, you don't saying, like, the, it seems like a bunch of people... Your ankle off, yeah. usually you, you do that. So. <laughs>